thanks so much. Welcome to the Halftime Report. I'm Scott Walker, front and center this hour, streaking stocks. The major average is going for eight straight weeks of gains. That is the best run in years. The investment committee now debates how to play things as history suggests. The Santa Claus rally starts today. Joining me for the hour, Joe Terranova, Stephanie Link, Jim Lamenthal. Let's check the market for green across the board. PCE was good. The data was good. Nike, not good. Nike's on pace for its worst day since September of 22. That's taking about 100 points off the Dow. So the Dow doesn't look as good because as bad as Nike is today, which leads us to our top story for the very reason. The lady who told us mm. she was scared to death <laughs> going into this number says she's selling it going out of the number. Ugh. That's it? Just sell it? Yeah, first I think the quarter was fine. I don't think it was terrible. It was exactly as I expected. We were talking yesterday actually about flat revenue growth. We got flat revenue growth, but we also got better profitability, which is the thing that kind of kept me in the name. Yeah. I mean, it was much, gross margins were much better than expected. Outlook, though, no good. But no, the outlook was not very good. And so it's like an opportunity cost is really what I'm, the way I'm thinking about it. I think that they will eventually get to low single, low double digit, upper single digit revenues eventually, Scott. But I don't know the timing. I think it's actually been pushed out as a result. They have a product cycle that's happening next year, but that's going to take a long time to get into the system. So for me, I think there are just better other ideas elsewhere within retail, but also within the broader market. You think this is... Um... I do. I do. At least for the next six months. I really do. And so I would rather take that money. By the way, I'm up on the position a lot. The stock is still up 27% from the lows seen a month and a half ago. So I'm, I'm taking some of the profits and I'm going to deploy them into other things. I just think right now I don't necessarily need to buy something with the market, you know, kind of on a tear. This says that the 15% run since November 1st yep. was bogus. That it, it was built on... No. I don't think bogus. Nothing. No, 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 no. That's too, that's way too, too, well, too Well, it's giving back 11% now. But it's also up from the lows. It was up 37% from the lows, recent lows a couple of months ago. I know, so. but January 1st to October 31st, the stock was down like 12%. Yeah. Everything that we've seen of late for this name has happened since November 1st till today, okay. or till yesterday, before the sell-off happened after earnings. Who concerned either? Said they're going to get it right. Um, they're on their way to doing so. I'll come to you in a second, because i got to go to you first, Farmer Jim. You sold the stock not that long ago, correct? Last week. Last week. That was a good call. Um, yeah, I mean, some of it had to do with the luck of my timing of getting in right after the last quarter, which Jimmy was... Jimmy Festive. That's what I'm calling you for the rest yeah, of the show. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's, let's see if we can stay this way through the whole show. <laughs> I don't know. missing the Santa hat. Okay, all right. But, uh, well, Santa <laughs> didn't come to Nike shareholders. We'll say that. No, he did not. Um, look, this, this is a turnaround story. I mean, apropos of what you were saying about the first half of this year, actually most of the year the stock was down, people were looking for a turnaround. The last quarterly report gave a very good sign that the turnaround was in place. But with the guidance and the verbiage, the commentary that we got last night, I, I think there's considerable question. First off, no signs of help from China. That's an important part of the equation. But what you really didn't want to see is softening of demand in North America.